Hello guys, this is a new tutorial on how to do a backbend. So again, we're outside. So, one of the main things you will need is to do stretches. Stretches are one of the things that will not make you hurt yourself when you're in the So, I like to call a seal stretch. So you just keep it on your back and go like this. It's kind of like a. Yeah. <laughs> I kind of do it out. So you go like this. This is also called scorpion. It also helps. But bring your leg up to your feet as you bring your head. So basically, you're trying to touch your, your head to your feet, but I'm not going to because I have gross shoes on. <laughs> Okay, as you notice, I don't know if you can see, but I can touch it. So those two stretches will help a lot. completely forgot about her. You want to have your legs separated like this and also kind of bend it like that. Okay. So now, after exactly a few times, you can probably start getting it about halfway, I'd say. I'd say this might take you like, say three days to a week. Maybe even two. Depending on how much you can. So another thing I like to do is grab onto the back of my legs as I'm going down and just like kind of use my legs as like that thing to walk down. But you're still also as you're going down you want to be like holding, like stepping forward just a little bit. So and make sure you start with hands up like this. And as you go down, no matter what, 
on your back because that's the one thing you want to try doing because you don't want to try a whole bunch of things at a time you want to just work on one so also when I was working on my back bend I had somebody hold my back like this as I started to bend as I started to bend my back I had my legs separate and bend my knees so they're holding your back like this, so it's called spotting, so they make sure you don't fall. So you'll, your back will be on top of their hands, basically. They'll start like this, this is how I like to do it, or that, like this. And then as you get in, you start to move it, and you'll probably end up about like this. And they don't have to be on your knees or anything, you can stand up. And as they are holding your back, go ahead and start bringing your hands down. No matter what you want to start and end with your hands here. And try and keep your head off the floor. Just remember that. You can also get like a mat. I use that to like level it and stuff. So like let's say it's about like right here. So if I'm going in the back bend. I'm going in the back bend against my back right here. So right here. And my back gets to like rest on it as I'm going down. That's another thing that will definitely help you. So okay, let's move the camera. So there's not much you can do but also you can do spider fingers which is just here. And that will help a lot. So, uh, yeah, I think that's all. Just remember to bend your knees, have them separated, keep your hands up at all times, keep your head up, and keep stretching. If you can do that, then you are going to be great. Don't forget to put pillows under yourself so you don't hurt yourself or just something like the mat as I said before. And yeah, have a great day. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.